Let's take the example of an automobile to understand the composite characteristics and the different dimensions of quality. When you consider performance as a dimension of quality, it includes primary product characteristics, such as the fuel economy of a car. When you consider features as a dimension of quality, it includes secondary characteristics or added features, such as climate control. When you consider conformance as a dimension of quality, it includes meeting industry standards, such as pollution standards. When you consider reliability as a dimension of quality, it includes consistency of performance over time, such as the engine starts every time, even in cold weather. When you consider Durability is a dimension of quality, it includes useful life of a product or service, such as time to replace batteries or brakes. When you consider service as a dimension of quality, it includes resolution of problems and complaints, such as time to deliver or repeating complaints. When you consider Experience is a dimension of quality, it includes attitude and tone of response, such as courtesy of the dealer. When you consider aesthetics as a dimension of quality, it includes sensory appearance, such as finish on the car. Thus, performance, features, conformance, reliability, durability, service, experience, and aesthetics come together to make up the dimensions of quality. The definition of quality can now be expanded based on the dimensions of quality. Unlike conventional wisdom, quality isn't restricted to errors, defective components, incorrect information, and complaints. Characteristics such as on-time delivery of products or services, employee attitude, turnaround time, and more, are also considered as performance measures of quality. Pick examples from your existing industry or institution for each of the eight dimensions of quality. Fill up the attached form, name dimensions of quality, and discuss the results with your mentor. Please try and complete this activity within 10 minutes.